what they told me. And I asked the question when I, when I turned pro. And I said, what one thing will help me be a good golfer? And they, all of them said this. This all independently. It wasn't a group. They said, go and watch and play with the best players. How did you recently? I, I grew up with my father's friends in a similar way. My uncle Weston, my uncle Jack, my uncle Sam. Uh, if only one of them was a real uncle. But I loved them. I loved caddying for them, being around them. They were funny, and they encouraged me. And, and at, at the end, they gave me a few pounds to start off as a pro. They believed in me, uh, and I was a five handicap. You see these kids coming off the conveyor belt, college conveyor belt with an entourage these days. It's totally different. It's in some ways, I think it's harder for them. But I think uh, the mentors have been uh, replaced by coaches of different sorts. You know, the swing coaches, the mental coaches, the physical training coaches. Entourage. Uh, yeah, and uh, it, it was funny. Uh, I think it was, uh, where was it, at Burkdale. We walked to the practice tee, and Neil Oxman, my wonderful caddy, uh, he's, he's, he's at the practice tee, and I'm signing autographs. And I walk out, kind of in the open like this. And I'm walking toward Neil. And I'm, and I'm going to walk past him. He said, stop. And I go, what do you mean, stop? And he said, look at this practice tee. And you had maybe 30 players hitting practice shots. Each one had five or six coaches and people behind going like this, like this. You know, they took, you know, rep, you know manufacturing representatives. All, yeah. all we just talked about. And then there was Greg Norman. He and his caddy. Yeah. And said, Greg and you are the only guys out here. Yeah. Out on a rush. And I think, you know, you know, listen, if it works, it works for these players. Yeah. You know, to, and to, to go and, uh, and, and rely on, on coaches and, and, and these things to help them out. We just did it differently. Yeah. We watched these players practice. I mean, when we went on the practice tee, and we're hitting balls. And on the tee walked Sam. Everybody would be hitting balls like this, and then all of a sudden they have some sort of reason to go and go over their bag, you know, change gloves, but really what they're doing, they're watching Sam swing the golf club. Yeah. When, when he walked on the tee, I just quit practicing. I went right behind him and just watched him. Yeah. I watched him the whole time until yeah. he quit because he, he gave me the rhythm that helped my golf swing. I know that. But that's the advice that you were given? That's right, exactly. That's the advice. Watch the best players play for a reason.